Hello, I'm the Retro Rooster. In this new series, I'll analyse and give a unique point of view to the traditional portrayal and tropes associated with villains in movies, television and more by talking about a specific villain from popular culture. In this episode, we'll be looking at both Rick Prime and Evil Morty, the two overarching antagonists from the adult animated science fiction show Rick and Morty. Evil Morty first appears in Season 1 episode, Close Rick Counters of the Rick Kind, where, along with Evil Rick, starts a Rick killing spree across the infinite dimensions, only to be followed by the Rick and Morty from Dimension C-137. However, it's later revealed that Evil Rick was just a puppet controlled by his Morty. In the Season 3 episode, the Rick Lantis mix-up, he starts a candidacy for President of the Citadel of Ricks, which he wins. He isn't seen again until the last episode of Season 5 where he's able to leave the central finite curve and thus enters a gold portal to parts unknown. Meanwhile, Rick Prime is the Rick that killed the main Rick's original family and the original grandfather of the main Morty. Whilst he first appeared in the flashback in the episode The Rick Shank Redemption, where it is shown that he offered the main Rick the chance to become the infinite Rick, but was turned down and thus killed the Diane and Beth of the main Rick. He didn't appear in true form until the first episode of season six, where he is last seen having killed the Jerry from the Cronenberg dimension. As of the making of this video, it's unknown if either Rick Prime or even Morty will appear in the seventh season of Ricky and Morty. That concludes this week's episode of Villainology. This is the Retro Rooster saying goodbye.